Hi guys, welcome back to Charlie and me, our camping vlog. This video is brought to you with thanks to our friends at the Motorhome Parking App Ireland. It's available for free or you can buy a yearly subscription and get the full version. As you know, we're in COVID, if you've seen the last video, it was a, st a stopover instead of for Moy because of the disastrous time we had there in County Cork. So we want to go somewhere tonight. And I brought in the Motorhome parking app and I keyed in Cork. I don't want to go near Cork City because there's a lot of round roadworks at the roundabout and down at the Jack Lynch Tunnel. So I just want to avoid that. And I want to head towards home, Waterford direction. So I think I said, we'll go to Ballycotton. It's a quiet location for a free overnight, high up overlooking 180 degrees of the Atlantic Ocean, no facilities. Seemingly, it's a cliff top car park. According to the map, Ballycotton is 40 minutes from here. So that's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna get this guy over here, strapped up. A little bit of road footage. You can skip the road footage to here, with the exception of where we're just coming into Ballycotton. If Ballycotton is too rough, as in weather-wise, I'll move on and would we'll possibly stay in Middleton, but I'll tell you more about that when we get to Ballycotton. Right, Charlie Brown, let's go. Over there, sweetie. No, thank you. Move. Ballycotton Scenic Car Park and they weren't messing. There's one at a motorhome here and a couple of people heading off for a walk. But OMG. I'd say it'd be pretty wild up here tonight in fairness because it's only um, afternoon now. It's not it's only 10 to 12 and it's very, very stormy. I'm gonna get a lead on this guy and we're gonna just take a trip outside. So I found a sheltered area. I didn't bring a microphone with me. Is that a big boat? A massive big thing actually. But we're looking out onto it, like turn this camera. Excuse the wind noise guys. I'm gonna go back to the camper to get my camera. Lots of monuments here to people who have lost their lives at sea, and rightly so. There's some lovely seating area along by this big relic of a boat. It's the only place I can get calm where there's no wind noise. It's raining, it's raining heavy now. So we're going to head back to the camper. We're not going to stay here tonight, but I did want to show it to you. It's on the Motorhome Ireland parking app. The views are stunning, absolutely stunning. This is fabulous as well. So we made it back out of the wind and rain. We're parked on a bit of a slope, so another reason not to park here. Um, there seems to be a little pitch and put club just here beside us. There's recycling bins here beside us. And 
there's one camper parked on the only flat part. We are literally at an angle. So we're gonna make a cup of tea, have some biscuits, and then we're going to hit the road and head towards Middleton a little bit later on. I'll edit some video while I'm here. But this is, a, I'd say during the summer, it's a fabulous spot. It's not an official, there's nothing saying you can't park here. There's only about 10, maybe 12 car parking spaces. Um, but yeah, it's a nice spot. It really, really is a nice spot in Ballycotton. You can walk down to the harbour. There's chip shops, there's pubs, the usual stuff. But a fabulous cliff walk along here. We just did half what you would have seen there. Sorry about the quality of that video. It was just done on my phone. Right, I'm going to get the kettle on. We're going to have some tea and biscuits. We are on a real bad slope here. The kettle keeps <laughs> sliding off the cooker. Thanks to our friends at Pat Horan Motors in Eglish for the mugs. I don't have a Charlie and me mug. We're going to rectify that as soon as we get home. They're all in the Heimer. So let's get ourselves a cup of tea. For those of you that travel with a dog, I'm sure like me and Deirdre, you never get to finish a full biscuit. I'm gonna to have to share this one too. I love biscuits dunked in tea. Mm. And of course, you have to share. So we've been here for about an hour. We had our cup of tea and biscuits. I did a bit of video editing. Your yeah, man is, hang on a second, fast asleep there. A lot of people have come and gone for walks. So I will say to you, this is a very popular spot with locals or whatever. So I don't think it's a great spot to park up for camper vans. It is if you want to come for an afternoon, go on the cliff walk. Um, I know people do park down the harbour. I think it's frowned upon. However, if you wanted to come for an afternoon stop, this is ideal. We are on some slope. I was washing the Delph from our tea and biscuits earlier on and the water is still in the sink. So I'm going to have to wait till we drive off before that empties. So it's not really suitable. Maybe at night time, if you're the only person here, you could park up on the only flat that seemed to be there just beside us. Right, we're going to move to Middleton and we're going to stay the night in Middleton. Middleton is also being recommended on the app, which of course we're sponsored by the Motorhome Parking App Ireland. It's available on Android and on iPhones and all that crack from the Google Play Store or wherever you get your apps. There's a free version and there's a fully paid up version as well. So the next bit of road footage you see will just be us pulling into Middleton.
Hi guys, we made it to Middleton Motorhome Parking Airs as shown on the Motorhome Parking Ireland app. Okay, it's the Distillery Lane car park. It's a massive car park and there are signs up and I'll take a photograph of the sign and it shows motorhome where it shows parking, water, wastewater disposal, overnight parking, 48 hours maximum stay. It's even called an air in A-I-R-E, an alternative air. Now, here's the deal, and a few people have said this to me. This car park is full all day long. It's really only suitable if you come down here in the evening time. Um, I'd say on a Friday night and Saturday night, the shops are probably open till 9 o'clock. There is one camper van over there, and there's 1,005,863 cars, give or take 1,005,000 cars. I just happened to get a parking spot. It's just a car park. They're not elongated bays. They're not extra bays. There's somewhere for you to drop your water. And there's somewhere for you to fill up. We are not staying here tonight because it's only two o'clock in the afternoon and I don't even have room to get out, to be honest. I'm going to try and get this guy out here just so he can do his business on the grass and then we're going to head back to base. But the motorhome parking app for free or if you buy it for five forty nine a year, flipping brilliant. You have the choice of airs, campsites, places where to get gas, places where to get bins. It's a flipping brilliant app. And thank you to the guys for sponsoring these videos. From me, Aaron, from this geezer, Charlie. Thank you for joining us on Charlie and Mayor Camping Vlog. Don't forget, you can subscribe if you haven't done so already. You don't have to. But uh, if ever you see us on a campsite over this coming season for 2022, like so many people this weekend, we've met five people this weekend, please do call over and say hi. From me, Aaron, from Charlie. Take care of yourselves and we'll talk to you very, very soon on Charlie and me, our camping vlog. Oh, take care. Bye-bye.